Hi, this is Mark White. I'm Executive Director for the Iowa Bicycle Coalition and your host on the Iowa Bicycle Coalition's YouTube channel. We're doing an update for this week and this is the first week going into the second week of July. And I want to talk about a few of the things that are happening around the state in, in bicycling. Um, we had two bicyclists killed within about a week's time frame. Uh, Jerry Williams down in, in New Lenox and Paul Ladd uh, around Boone. Um, we've also had another hit and run for a bicyclist and we had uh, another bicyclist that was injured enough that they were flown by helicopter uh, near Marion. Um, we're shocked and saddened that these things happen. We want to remind drivers out there to pay attention to driving. Um, it's so important that we have safe roads out there for everybody. It's not just us, but it's also the kids that are out there on bicycles. And it's important that we're all safe. On a lighter topic, the other news we had this week was Lance Armstrong's returning to Iowa for the fifth time to try to finish Rag Bright. Now, if you recall, the seven-time Tour de France champion or former Tour de France champion, however you want to look at it, um, has never been able to finish the big ride, and it doesn't look like he's going to do the whole thing this year, but he's going to give it another try. Um, he's going to start probably in Council Bluffs and finish somewhere in Des Moines. We're going to welcome all those 10,000 riders, so whether they're uh, a disgraced uh, former Tour de France champion uh, that would have admitted doping in Oprah Winfrey, or whether they're just the person that's trying ride ride for the first time and enjoying themselves off the with the Iowa hospitality. Uh, so keep an eye out for Lance and whatever your opinion is, uh, just make sure that you know that this is Iowa and, and uh, this, is, this is the way Rag Bri is. Third thing that I want to talk about is our upcoming presence that we're going to have at the Bikes, Blues, and Barbecue in Clear Lake, Iowa. Now this is, a, this is an annual event that combines uh, more than a bike race. Uh, there's a bike race, there's a family fun ride, uh, there's barbecue vendors, and the Iowa Bicycle Coalition is going to be there. So we're really excited about that opportunity uh, to be there in Clear Lake. We'll be going up Friday night for their, their expo and their opening. Uh, we'll be there Saturday morning and Saturday during the Criterium. So look forward to uh, come stopping by the Iowa Bicycle Coalition booth and seeing what we have to offer. Hey, I had a good time this weekend at 8035, which is the music festival in Des Moines. But the other person that had a great time this weekend in Des Moines was David Byrne of the Talking Heads. He performed there with St. Vincent at, uh, at the 8035 Music Festival on Friday, but he also did a couple secret trips around town. If you know, David Byrne's a really big fan of bicycling. And rumor has it he stopped by Ichi Bike in the East Village. Um, he was really excited. And then his blog post said he took a 30-mile trip trip on the trails in and around the central Iowa area, so that was exciting. Me, I stuck to dirt. We went on the center trails and the banner trails and got about three hours of mountain biking in, so that was, uh, that's a lot of fun. Hey, it's not too late. You can still register for the Gable Grand Fondo, www.grandgable.com. We just had two riders test ride our route, and they said it's challenging. So if you're out there to race, this is going to be a great event for you. If you're out there to do your first century, this is going to be one of the best uh, supported rides that you're ever going to find and some of the best swag that you're going to ever have out there. And it, then if you're out there to really do your best, this one's going to be a lot of fun, a lot of challenge, but a lot of uniqueness because this is a grand fondo, and that means big ride. Put your comments in the box below. Subscribe to our channel if the uh, button's shown above. Come back here because we're doing weekly updates on Iowa bicycling, so stay tuned. Hey, don't forget to subscribe. Just click that button.